Yo, what it is, YouTube? Is your boy Neezy coming back with another bullseye of a tutorial here today on the channel? So, we're gonna do a dope vocal preset for Osama Sun, really dope rapper, a part of the underground wave. And, you know, I really fuck with my subscribers, you know, especially the ones who like underground music and shit like that, too. So shout out to y'all for giving me this great suggestion. If y'all do like this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Suggest more artists down below and uh, so we can keep these going. And if you want to get the preset, you can uh, get it in the link down below. So let's go. I really really dope type of vocal that I want to break down his vocal is like really like different uh it reminds me of Ken Carson a little bit in general um, you know, a summer sun, but he got his own style though, bro. His actual vocal, how it's all lulling like this, but is it like you feel me? That kind of reminds me of Ken Carson. But this is the song, what is it, FLXR or something like that? A really dope, a really dope track. And I just like how the vocal was different. So let's get to it. Uh, let's see what it sounds like with and without the preset. Man, nothing. Three a.m. I told him punch me and rock or rock or nothing. Bitch, I'm clutching. Bitch, pussy bluffing. We got hell sticks in the fuck. Pull up, got that black shit busting. Big ass faucet, keep it ducking. You crawl hard, man, nothing. Three a.m. I told him punch me and rock or rock or nothing. Bitch, I'm clutching. Bitch, pussy bluffing. We got hell sticks in the fuck. Pull up, got that black shit busting. Big ass faucet, keep it ducking. You crawl hard, man, nothing. Yeah, so you guys hear me, that's me trying to do my best impression of Osama's son. All right, so uh, most important thing, bro, I pulled out, you know, um... A clipper. I use the Shep's Omni channel because I know that it has all the other shit I'm gonna need, which is the um EQ compression, all that. But you can use any type of clipper, another great clipper. If you if you're using FL Studio, which is most people who like FL Studio is even better than Pro Tools, in my opinion. I, you know, started mixing some songs at FL Studio and that shit is so fun, bro. No cap. But that's another conversation for another day. If y'all want to see FL Studio tutorials, bro, tell me. Okay, and I would do it. Okay, so boom, look, I'm using the Shep's Omni channel. Boom, I put it on the heavy mode. I'm getting uh clipping, clipping distortion, which is pretty much like me throwing some jala jalapeno, habanero, hot sauce, ooh, some Tabasco on that vocal right out the gate. Super aggressive, 24 dB octave cut on the low end of the vocal because the low end is so skimpy but the thing about it is the the, the distortion is actually gonna you know muck, mucky up the mid-range too if you ever have a kick and you put a clipper on it you'll hear how like it kind of over exaggerates the mid-range all right so after that we have like this soft knee compressor or whatever whatever and I, I put it on a very aggressive and i blent it in you feel me i like doing this move to get a vocal aggression very early on and then of course big big scoops big mega hagen dazs scoops of ice cream in that low mid in that low end, you feel me? And then just a little crack at the top. You crawl hard, soft man, it shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told him punch it. Me and Rock go rock or nothing. You crawl hard, soft man, it shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told him punch it. Me and Rock go rock or nothing. You crawl hard, soft man, it shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told him punch it. Me and Rock go rock or nothing. You crawl hard, soft man, it shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told him punch it. Me and Rock go rock or nothing. You crawl hard, soft man, it shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told him punch it. Me and Rock go rock or nothing. You crawl hard, soft man, it shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told him punch me and rock or rock or nothing. You crawl hard, soft man, it shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told him. All right, all right. So after that, we have a DSer, and I think it's only doing like a couple of dBs. You crawl hard, soft man, it shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told him punch me and. And I picked this DSer over here because this DSer is a little bit sloppy. You feel me? It's like that motherfucker who who was kind of drunk a little bit late night and they just tripping over and they hung over and all that stuff like that. So I picked this DSer because it's sloppy. I'm going for that on purpose. You feel me? Like dirty on purpose. Like, you know, like when people wear street wearing and their shit got rips in the jeans and rips on the shirts. And but it's just fashion. It's the aesthetic. So that's why I picked the, this DSer because this DSer is kind of sloppy a little bit. And it's contributing to that, that, that three, that the lethargic tone of Osama's son. Uh, let me look at the auto tune two. Okay, standard five and ten. All right, nothing crazy. You know, sometimes I change it, but for the most part, it's always coming down to the performance with the auto tune. You know, 
Um, then I use the pop vocal preset. This is adding a little bit of that jumping jack huh, huh, type of hype with the vocal. I When I use this plugin, it reminds me of a slingshot because it's pulling the vocal back and letting it pop forward type shit like that. And crown high stuff, man, they shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. And crown high stuff, man, they shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. And crown high stuff, man, they shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. And crown high stuff, man, they shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. And that's the thing about that specific song with Osama Sun is like the mid range is very hollow. You feel me? Like an empty fucking room with nothing in it. Like if you had your bedroom, right? Like, you know, you're talking in your bedroom, but in a, a second, boom, I snapped my fingers and all the, the bed, the computer, the table in your room was completely removed, right? The, the sound would be different. It would just sound hollow. So I just heard that sound in his vocal that the mid range is hollow and I just literally did it with this plugin but very delicately though you know because sometimes if the vocals are too hollow in the mid it will sound robotic almost like an ai or some shit like that it will lose the soul of the humanity you know so then i use the api 2500 and i think i use this just for the components in it more like a saturator i put it on a limiting ratio so that it wouldn't really get triggered that much but this is, I'm using this more for like the color, just running through. And crown high stuff, man, they shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. And crown high stuff, man, they shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. And crown high stuff, man, they shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. And crown high stuff, man, they shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. And crown high stuff. And of course, for the haters, we got it on manual makeup mode. No added volume and it just bro it just adds presence that plugin just no understand the components vca circuitry you feel me you gotta know this shit bro because look look at that i'm like yo i want more presence but i don't even gotta do a boost in eq because i know that plugin is gonna produce that 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 forward type of mid-range tone coming from those components all right and then after that, we have a REQ. I did like a little, a, a baby, a sissy, a sissy low, a low shelf. And it's like a really broadband low shelf. I'm scooping out low end, like I said. In this song, it sounds like a wall that is hollow. You feel me? Like a wall that has no insulation in it in the crib. Like you never, you ever been in a house that was like pre-built or some shit and there's no insulation in the walls? Like it just feels like there's a lack of thickness to the vocal you feel me but it's still okay you know so yeah that's what i did i used the low shelf to scoop out that low mid did a notch and then it did like a a, a, a mid-range broadband bump just like really shifting up a lot of the energy upwards type shit and crown high stuff man they shit nothing 3 a.m i told them punch it me and rock gon' rock or nothing and crown high stuff man they shit nothing 3 a.m i told them punch it me and rock gon' rock or nothing and crown high stuff man they shit nothing 3 a.m i told them punch it me and rock gon' rock or nothing and crown high stuff man they shit nothing 3 a.m i told them punch it me and rock gon' rock or nothing all right after that we have the rvox and i only use this rvox right here just for just a little bit of like like how i said a pinch you know, it reminds me of like pinchers, you know, like pincers, pincers, you know, that, that the metallic ass thing that people be having that they use to like pinch screws and pull out nails. Like if you bang a nail into a wall, you get a, you get a pincer. A, what is it? Is it called a pincer? I don't fucking know. They grab that shit and then they, it pulls the nail out. So I'm trying to pull out more presence out of the vocal. That's why I'm pinching it specifically. You feel me? So that's what the Arvox is doing. And crown high stuff, man, they shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. And crown high stuff, man, they shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. After that, I have a, a, a nice moderate amount of the fresh air i didn't even do it aggressively bro his vocal is already naturally bright crown high right there this thing at 3 a.m and the, also the clicks in the mouth to make the vocal sound brighter than what it really is and crown high stuff man they shit nothing 3 a.m i told them punch it me and rock gon' rock or nothing and crown high stuff man they shit nothing 3 a.m i told them punch it me and rock gon' rock or nothing and crown high stuff man they shit nothing 3 a.m i told them punch it me and rock gon' rock or nothing and crown high stuff man they shit nothing 3 a.m i told them punch it me and I go rock another and crown high stuff man they shit nothing 3 a.m I told them punch it me and I go rock another like it's kind of like that same tone crown high side of it it's like a like a really tongue smacking clicky type of tone Osama Sun has to his vocal boom quarter note delay broadband broadband 
because that vocal, like the original, the lead vocal, is just so radio and just so focused on the mid range. So I just did a broadband delay. <laughs> and I blent it in at a low level to kind of make the vocal feel thicker than what it is. Like I've been saying this whole time, hollow walls, a scoop of ice cream, feel me, hollow ass vocal. That's why I use the broadband ass delay, bro, to make it still feel like it has a, you know, a wide spectrum to it. You feel me type shit. And like it's still, it's not missing any of the frequencies. Like, a, you know, it's like a puzzle. You feel me? You always want your vocals to feel like a complete puzzle that has all the pieces in it. You don't ever want to like, you never see nobody put up a, 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 a one of those art, the puzzle arts in their house that is like missing a bunch of pieces and shit because it probably fall apart. You know, so you don't want your vocal to fall apart. You still want it to still have some sense of uh, that fullness. And that's coming down to a doubler stomp too. You know, a doubler stomp is playing into that. And you see my EQ move, just making sure my mid range, but I got that mid range on point. You know, so uh, our verb on reverse reverb, well, I don't know what it is, but even even look at the reverbs. You see, this is, I'm mixing with intention. Boom. My reverb is full range, all the booty, all the top end. You feel me? All the booty, all the, the, the hair. You feel me? Everything is there. You feel me? Like a real fucking broadband you know, reverb. You feel me? That's kind of like, you know. Bringing everything together. You call hard stuff, man, this shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock another. You call hard stuff, man, this shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock another. You call hard stuff, man, this shit nothing. So, yeah, you know, it still has the lows. It still has the highs in a certain type of way. And then I use the CLA-76 on distortion mode, on super hot, spicy, jalapeno mode, to be exact, all buttons in. And that's giving me more distortion, digital distortion, you know? So I use the clipper to get some digital hot sauce. And I'm using the CLA-76, red lighting that bitch for some more hot sauce. You feel me? That's how I like my, my fries and my chicken. You feel me? With, with the spicy wings, bruh. Call hard stuff, man, this shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock another. Call hard stuff, man, this shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock another. Call hard stuff, man, this shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock another. Call hard stuff, man, this shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock another. Okay, so now let's look at the ad libs real fast. Call hard stuff, man, this shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. Bitch, I'm clutching. Bitch, I'm clutching. Big pussy bluffing. We got hell sticks in the function. Pull up, got that black shit busting. Big ass faucet, keep it ducking. Call hard stuff, man, this shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. Bitch, I'm clutching. Bitch, I'm clutching. Big pussy bluffing. We got hell sticks in the function. Pull up, got that black shit busting. Big ass faucet, keep it ducking. Call hard stuff, man, this shit nothing. 3 a.m. I told them. All right, boom. Transient control on them L1s. Rock, rock or nothing. You feel me? I just want to flatten out. Whew, I just want to burst the bubble on the ad lib so they feel flatter. That's why you see, like, when you do it like this, 10 10, or you just link mode, you're not changing the volume. You're just changing how much of the transient you're grabbing. By the way, you see, I do that shit all the time, bro. I'm just controlling the transient. I'm controlling how full one balloon feels and how flat the other balloon is. You feel me? Compare and contrast, my nigga, boom. Cut off the low end, boom. Did a, a shelf, a, a bell boost, actually. That's like I get a gradual amount of high end. And then I used the API 2500. I'm boom, I'm boosting the air into this compressor that has a side chain tilt, uh, boom. So it's ramming the pre, uh, it's ramming the vocals on a hard knee. You feel me? And this really just makes the vocals jump forward. This makes the, the ad libs jump forward. So I rock or nothing. Rich on clutching, rock or nothing. You feel me? I want that. I want that type of ad lib to have a swinging momentum to it. That's that's swinging like a motherfucking jit at the goddamn uh, playground on the seat on the on the saw, just swinging back and forth. Like I want the ad lib to swing farther. So that's why I use this this compression right here. You feel me? You call hard stuff, man. This shit nothing. This Three a.m. I told them punch it. Me and Rock gon' rock or nothing. Go rock or nothing. Bitch on clutching. Bitch on clutching. Big pussy bluffing. We got hell sticks in the function. Pull up, got that black shit. This is a great plugin too, cause it's got automatic uh, gain control. And then we have the Arvox, just using it for the gate. And we have this uh, stock reverb, pretty much. And then uh, eighth note delay. You feel me? 
So that's pretty much the end of the Osama Sun uh, vocal tutorial here today. If you guys do like the preset, grab it down below. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and suggest more artists that y'all want to see me do a vocal preset for. Appreciate y'all now, YouTube game. Check the next video. Peace.